this is my part b tutorial here we will create the link.html the below type i'll create one page like link that's all i will do then i will do the forms create new page here the page name is save as link.html link that's all i'll do i want to type two information here you can see chocolate gallery and speed so i type chocolate gallery i won't give any link because my idea is i want to create a frame i want to do the target frame this was over so now i will do it the form how to create form this is a page feedback.html is there this is called form in the form i have form elements create a new page new page and name as save feedback feedback of html i'll save the page here. there is two method one is i can write like this feedback and name first do it like this form select the form drag it drag and click now form will come like this so if a form is coming select the form if four arrow is coming means it is selecting inside the form put all the elements here type feedback and you can do here what is given name colon this text box name give space colon give space this is one method or another method this way if you are aligning you difficult go and insert the table insert table so how many columns maybe i can put five rows and two columns i'll give like this so i will type here name then alignment is easy so i'll give here name or otherwise here i'll put name name colon use so i can reduce the so i can make the row Here I can reduce the table size. What is this? This is called text input text. Here you can go and see input text is coming. Just drag it. One with bigger input text. Next one. The next one is gender male and female. This is a radio button. So go here. Gender. Type gender here. colon give space and then how it is designed male and then female so male type male give space always give space otherwise what will happen is it will overlap like this so this is where and then it is give space female if i am not giving space can you see here i will show it will become like this the alignment not perfect so you always space you on space and put space actually here the female is selected option so what i will do is i'll go here right click the mouse form field properties this is my property i'll select radio button one if you select that if you select it means it give value one like this two so it will select it now this not male female is selected like this i can suppose i want to select mail how i do change it form field property go to two selected this one not not selected selected this one do okay now it will be selected so again i will show form field property go this one selected go this one so next one is what next two one is called branch branch is given so branch i will give here run this is drop down box if like this it is there this is called drop down box so what we do is we go here this is my drop down box inside the drop down box right click form field property what means the first one is empty here so remove it now i want to add the values add the values alphabetical
I'll give it three. Suppose it is selected, not selected means it will come. So now I want to add another one. Another one I'll say two. I'll say three. Next one I want to add. I want to add three. Three places I add it. Correct. Suppose I want to add Ruby to be displayed. What I will do? I want to do Ruby to be displayed here. Selected field. No, 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 no. It is given. It is given. Selected. Modify. Modify. Say what? Selected. Selected field. I give okay. Yes. Now you can see. Yes. I give okay. Whatever you selected, that will appear in the screen. That is a thing. So branch. Now I can go and see what is the next one. This is called text area. So I will go here. Here I go and I come. And go here. It should be look neatly. So text area. I will make it bigger. So this alignment should be perfect. In the same way, we can put what? If you want to put input, this is password box. Suppose I want to put input password. Then you see input password it is there. So I want to select here from field properties. What is the initial value or which of the character is maybe I can mean maybe initial value is something like that. What? 1, 2, 3, like this. I will give you access. One, two, this is my password. In the same manner, I want to give the um, reset and submit button. I can use reset button here. Not place the reset button. Then I can give submit button here. This way I can. I want to change the value from field property. Go and change the value. Okay. Like this, I can. So I can do the form field property from okay. Form field property, I can take whatever the uh, normal button like this, I can do. So this is called the how to create form. In the form, we can do. Now I will run the form. I will save it. I will run the form. If you click, all things are coming. So we can make it. So there is whatever you can type. So this is a way I can use the form, the forms items and form whatever it may be there some controls I can use, I can define my, this is a, so we can be introduced in the